in the same players are out. West Ham need to get a win today after a couple of uh, away defeats. So we're going to go West Ham 3 1. Come on, your eyes. Some of it on the stadium, it's uh, West Ham deal with it, deal. as you've just seen the clips of the first half, not a lot really happened to be honest, um, a bit of a drab affair, the views uh, in the sky would have been too thrilled with that first half, neither the fans of the stadium, um, yeah, not really much to really report in terms of chance, they must have had the slight merit of things, but that's not really saying much, um, the Kelton had a the chance to uh, get an effort on goal, should have done a lot better, terrible touch, um, should have forced people to save, and um, Jared Bowen, great play down the left from um, the crowd on the left. Good cross to um, Bowen and uh, Paul Meeple. We actually scuffed his effort on his strong left foot as well. So um, there was a bit of an incident with, um, with Kudos, who's looked lively, um, Talkowski and um, Pickford for Everton. Um, with Kudos and Pickford getting a yellow card. Now it's about the half hour mark. Since then, what really happened for the rest of that first half? So. West Ham taking too many touches and allowing Everton to get into good shapes and Everton growing in confidence as the more than half went on. So, uh, yeah, much improvement they're doing in the second half and the uh, start of the second half. We haven't started great this season in all competitions. So, much improvement they did. It's got to be a lot better because uh, we were playing a, a side in the top half. We're going to be uh, behind by now. Um, so, yeah, hopefully we're going to step up second half. Come on, your wines. I'm here in the London Stadium, it's West Ham nil, Everton won, and uh, a deserved win for Everton. Yes, but West Ham were absolutely shocking, and uh, think we even worse in the first half. Um, and again, I have it with Casido in the second half. This season happened again. Dominic Calvert-Lewin played very well for Everton, probably man of the match. Um, you know, uh, Antonio lost the ball in the halfway line. Good play by Harrison, fed it to uh, Calvert-Lewin. Good, uh, got a half yard, good finish into the corner. And we had no chance for it. And West Ham, same as the first, I'd say, probably even worse. Um, in the first half, uh, there was no movement. Pass was terrible. It was sluggish. Uh, even though we made changes from midweek, 
looked like we were actually dead on our feet uh, from the first whistle really so um, yeah really worrying that was really worrying performance ever they deserved it they defended fantastically um, and yeah they looked more of a friend the core should have made it 2-0 for Evan after a the Guerrero and Nzumu with a shaky all game. They went both went for the same ball. Quite brilliant save by Ariola to keep us in it. But uh, yeah, not good from West Ham at all. We to lose to obviously Villa, uh, you know, Man City, Liverpool in the league. It's, it's one thing, but lose to Everton who struggled last few seasons is, is another thing, especially here at home. So yeah, not not good. I need to step it up because uh, we're going to slide down that table if we don't uh, fix, you know, fix what we're doing. Um, so. And then ended there. Thanks everyone for watching. Subscribe to Gadget if you do, and uh, we'll see you on the next one. All the best. Take care.